Hello, how are you? Good. We have Do famous Dominic, famous Christopher, and rock star Trey Mama, Tracy here. How Hi. are you? Hi. We miss you. How are you? You guys, I'm good. Are you in different rooms? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We've been we've been doing it this professional way this time around. It's been working fabulous. I yeah. love it. <laughs> sharing a bench <laughs> pushing mom off the bench <laughs> well they don't fight so much if i'm not there so it's working out oh i just I love here. it <laughs> oh my gosh so mom can't kick you under the table if you say that something wrong i'm kidding <laughs> I'm like, I, I could probably still do that from here but that's okay <laughs> No. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I all things winter owl today. So like let's blow this box out of the water, right? So exciting. Yeah. Can you How's believe it? How's it going so far with the box? Good. I love we, it. We did a holiday show yesterday. Yeah. yeah it's been fun. Oh my so gosh. The um the uh like the shipment of plushies gets here, I think. This Mom? week, so they'll they're, they're all shipping out. We'll get them all shipped out this this week. That what's been ordered so far. Yeah, I yeah love so it's it. exciting. So exciting! Uh, all right, you guys ready for our live? Dom, Dom yeah. you might want to shake out your energy and get a little more excited. I know. Sorry, stay for you today. Like, shake it out, buddy. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, loosen up your mouth. Your exercises. Yes. yes. Get it shaken out. Yeah. There we go, buddy. Oh my gosh. The best ever. Okay. So, oh my gosh. I'm so excited. This is going to be so much We're fun. We're so excited. Thank you for doing this for us. Yes, of course. It's my yeah. pleasure. This is the perfect time because people are ready to buy these gifts right mm -hmm. now. They're in buying mode. Right. So let's do it. Um. All right. You guys ready for me to push go? Yeah. Ready. Yep. Okay, we are preparing and we are live on Facebook. Welcome everyone. Come on in here. I'm going to change my view so that we can all be here together. I am here with, oh, let me actually always forget to do this. I'm going to shut out my other screen. I am here with the incredible, we have Christopher, we have Dominic, we have Tracy Serino, and of course, along with them comes their incredible number one best-selling children's book, The Winter Owl. And we are here to talk about this book today, but in a really unique and special way, which is why I have labeled this very special live interview, a unique <laughs> Christmas gift and experience. So we are going to walk you through this unique Christmas holiday gift and experience today. Christopher and Dominic, welcome. Hello. Thanks. Hi, Tracy. Hi. Welcome. Hello. How are you? I'm great. So okay, so we're together. Okay, so let's get right to it for the people who are like, what is this unique experience and gift? So first and foremost, yes. Oh, we're just going right for it. Like, let's just do it. It's like, oh, the unveiling is here. I love it. So for those who don't know about the story of the winter owl, can uh, one of you or both of you, if you want to do it together, can you tell, bring us through the story, um, you know, like high level, you know, like just like a brief summary of what this story is about so people can get interested in the book if they're not, if they don't have it yet well the book is about a girl is about a young girl named gossamer who's taken to the north pole because she has this because she has to save it from darkness and it all it's all thanks to a, to a special winter owl named glitter and we are so happy that at, to everyone who gets and reads the books and we're so glad that we got to make this dream come true and now we have little plushies for it so there was another dream after the book was that was to create plushy characters. Is that right? That was actually our original goal. We want we wanted to we we saw like toys on a TV show thing for advertising yeah. stuff. So like we wanted to create create a toy, and that toy came with a book. So we decided to like that's how the Winter Owl came out, and now it's like a whole big thing. And maybe, and hopefully, people will cherish it for years to come. 
In fact, you might even love it. And it might even come a classic, like The Wizard of Oz. Uh, they will cherish it. For, I know I personally will cherish it for years to come. And I have a feeling a lot of other people will too. So can you introduce us to the characters and tell us a little bit about each one? This is the, this is this is the is our main character. Well, I guess you could say she is. He is. I mean, this is glitter, and he's a boy, even though he looks so cute. Here we have his curia. He is a cute little owl with a with a gold with a gold with a red chain with a gold thing. Yep. And his in her red Santa hat. He mm -hmm. bring is the one who helps who helps Gossamer. To Get through, gets the North Pole and helps her through challenges she faces. And that, and the next one is Chase, Gossamer's loving companion. Chase has been Chase is Gossamer's Arf, best friend, Arf, as most Arf, dogs are to us. And Arf, he's Arf. and he and he's tagged along on her adventure to the North Pole in order to help, in order to help her stop the evil going on there. Right. Very very important job. And speaking of evil, we'd like to introduce you to the man behind the behind it all, Krampus. Now, Krampus is not an original character. He is actually from classic folklore that has been adapted in various media. But we adapted him into a cute, into a cute one of his cuter versions. With he has his cute little, he has his nice little dark coat. He has a great white color scheme, and he has little devil horns. Yeah, that's, that's, right. he, I, that's what I thought was the funniest thing. I'm like, he's not that scary. I kind of love his coat. Oh my <laughs> gosh, he's got the best <laughs> going on. He's a fashion well, wow. And wow. while he might be evil, he still doesn't make him any less cute. Mm -hmm. Well, I think that's important for when the kids get the from a play standpoint. You know, you can you can play with all the characters. Yeah. Do you, do you oh, want to show oh. everybody um my favorite part on Gossamer? You yeah. guys remember? You got it. Now here we introduce Gossamer, the the this the, the main, one of the main characters. She is a she is as you can see here. She has beautiful yarn hair. It's not actually yarn. It's kind of like kind of like it looks like kind of like what you'd imagine what what oh, Jess, the Jesse doll from Toy Story would probably be like. So as you can see, she <laughs> has the she has a special coat given to her that allows. That allows her to breathe. That allows her to like to like not get cold in the North Pole. And here, and like she has her little cute little boots and pants. <laughs> like she's like you know, she's like a pretty cool dog. Yeah, you're like a pretty cool. She's like a pretty cool toy. I just love her coat with the zippers. I'm like yeah. these are killing me because it's like real. Like I'm like oh it's a toy with the cutest zippers. So I, I love the fashion statements. It is so, so good. Cute. It's so good. So are, is this all the characters, or do we, or, or is there one more? Those, those are all the characters. All those are all the characters. Yeah. Although, yeah. You couldn't, in, in although this, okay. you could include Santa if you wanted to. Yeah, Santa is also a character in the book. So remember, kids, if you want to read some, if you want to read Santa, he's right there. And if you look, he's not right there. And if you look closely at the box, you will see. Who took my favorite part? I know. Yes, right. we want to see. It. Oh wow. Yeah. Look at that. Oh my yeah. God. Show your favorite. So we designed the box so that it could be a keepsake for years to come. Yeah. Because these guys had that beautiful vision of wanting to create toys. And as a mom, I wanted to let I wanted to make the cuddle moments last longer. So yeah. that's where we were like, okay, how could we combine all the things yeah, that the families want? Here is one of my favorite scenes. Here is like my favorite scene on this thing. It shows Gossamer, Gossamer finally reunited with parents with Chase, with the Winter Owl, and Krampus all together in one big collage. So <laughs> this is your favorite part. The yeah. uh, Santa sleigh is your favorite. <laughs> Tracy, your favorite part is the zipper jacket. I'm getting it all. I understand. That's so I, funny. I know. Yeah, like um, just, actually, like, when, when it came parts. back to prototypes with the zippers, I'm like, this is the cutest thing ever. So anyway, so part. In three parts of the book, you can see in this first part, it's like here, like in the three parts of the book, we you there are different things for each of the characters. This one is about Gossamer. This one is about the Winter Owl and Krampus. You guys like you have, you have a when you have a good character, you have to stand up against that character. And over here, we have our good introduction to Chase. I love it. I love so, it. So cute. Great, great job on the packaging. I love yeah. it.
So tell yeah, me what else comes in this box, right? So you've shown us this beautiful keep safe box for years to come. We have this wonderful book that we've talked about. And, it's, characters. and yeah. here is the sticker, Amazon international best-selling Amazon. Oh, yes. yeah, I love it. it. <laughs> That they were very so I am so proud of that sticker and I know you are too and you yeah. should yes you should be absolutely yeah. so do you want to do you want to talk about all the digital stuff yeah, yeah. Uh, you want to share with people all of the goodies that you put together for them to be able to access I see videos of you reading and all these really cool things <laughs> tell us more about that well eat we will scan a QR code in, inside yeah. the book and each one of us will show videos. Like, and CRISPR can tell you like all the different kinds of videos. Oh, yeah. Christopher, did you do any of the videos? Yeah. Yeah, we, we all did. Oh, all three of you have them. Okay. Yeah. I saw a picture of Dominic think... doing it, but okay, got it. Yeah, so I, I, I will be some of the behind the scenes. So there is audio and video of... Um, of the kids just reading the book, um, of me just reading the book, there is um, video interactive so that like, say you need to hurry up and get something ready for dinner, but you still want your kids to learn to read. You yep. can put them in front of it. So yeah. we kind of thought of all the angles, like what could you do to sit down and have it be the more interactive experience? We even have videos about using the inside of the box to create like a play scene so that you can like bring in more toys that you, you know that you already have so yeah. we kind of really dug into creating as much of an interactive experience as possible i think in the end we i think we've marketed and said that there was going to be three bonuses i think at this point there's seven so we just added it because we were having so much fun making them i <laughs> love it this is so good so what is the price point on this for the moms out there who are watching well so, the price point is normally like for everything included, the cost of everything, the value is like over two ninety seven, but we're selling it at, for ninety seven. Oh, <laughs> Amazing! And Tracy, <laughs> will you or one of the boys be able to put like a link um down below once we're done, or a yeah. QR or something like that, where people can access this? Absolutely. Okay, so that's perfect. So easy, click. You know, kind of one click to be able to get yeah. to. Um, look at all of this that we're talking about. So there's like beautiful um, explanation of everything that we're talking about here. Very detailed and very straightforward. And I love it. So how do you, um, Dominic, let's start here. Where, how do you want children to feel or families to feel when they receive your box? That is a good question. Uh, well, all like all of my life, I've been like a kind of like imaginative person. Like he, like I've always like kind of lived in a fantasy world. So like everyone, so like, so like this is like my way, like in the real world of me, like becoming like, so like the way the book makes me feel is like all, like for me, books have always like made me feel calm and secure and like excited <laughs> and like, and like great. Like, I mean, like there's nothing like reading a good book. So they've been telling stories for the beginning of time all the way to K from cave paintings on the walls to move to movies in Hollywood. Movie? And now the Winter movie. Owl. Yeah. So I just hope <laughs> Winter Owl becomes when kids read it, like they're overcome with joy, happiness, and that they remember and that they remember it for years to come. Like that the parent is like a, a book that you'll remember like your parents read to you or like your yeah. teacher read to you and that you got read to you by someone. Yeah. So if I'm hearing you, it's like a whole experience, right? That's what they're going to Yeah. Do. That's what it is. The okay. winch, as it says right here. Oh, the winter owl experience. I'm on okay. brand. I did my research. <laughs> I'm sticking it. I know the lane. I'm in the lane. Okay. So Christopher, what about you? How, how do you, what do you hope um, children feel like when they get your box in the mail and they open it up? Like, how do you, how do you think that they're going to receive um, these these plushies and this book like how do you think that they'll feel when they see everything i think they'll feel happy excited and i and i would think they would feel really happy to have like uh to cuddle with stuff and have a good book to read i couldn't agree more i couldn't agree more i absolutely think children are going to be super happy 
um, to open nice. this, and they're gonna be excited when they find out. Oh, there, there's one character, two, three, four. Oh my and then, goodness! And then right? like, and like so they, many characters. And like when they get older, like they'll start like they'll start doing things. Like, have you ever known? Like, like here is an here is one interesting thing. Like when we were kids. We used to love playing with like all of our little toys together and yeah. like things like with our little sets. Like I had, <laughs> like when I was a kid, I had a bunch of Scooby Doo toys and we and I would like play with them all over, all around in the little mansion. Had my mom like buy me the mansion. I wanted to like buy every single minifigure, but but there were some I couldn't get. But still, because like I didn't want to like have two more than one set of monster of, of stuff. Mm -hmm. But like oh anyway, I'm just, anyway back to the trial. So like that's what I hope happens. Like the kids like can play with the set as a, its own like kind of box set. Like and like Christopher said, reenact the scenes. Yes. When they're yes. older, like if they choose to do this, like they can even like have you ever seen those like YouTube videos? Like when I, where like the people re use use like the toys and like tell stories of it. Like they can interact with different kinds of things. Like those story like, life online. Like story life. Oh yeah, like they read the stories, but I mean like use the toys. Right, to like reenact, yeah. Uh, when I when, when we me and my brother were younger, these those were so good. Mm -hmm. Even to this day, I sometimes look. I, even to this day, sometimes in a little while, I would I'll go online, I'll look up, I'll look up some stuff like Lego Legos from some stuff from Legos to see how the how the difference to see differences. I'll look up Lego Ninjago Legos, and then I'll look at the difference, and then I'll look up the differences because it's kind of entertaining. Yeah, it's super entertaining. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Um, I love all of these amazing ideas. Um, so Tracy, anything else that you would wish to add for the parent or the grandparent or, you know, the uh, person out there that might be interested in getting this for the little in their life? So the, the most important thing to the kid was the, to the kids was the plushie. <laughs> that was their vision even before writing the book. So that, that, that we had to stay true to that vision. But then as a mom, what was most important to me was having as many cuddle moments as possible and instilling the love of reading. So it was like, how can we combine those? Yeah. And then in the clients that I serve, the number one thing I hear from women that are grandmas are, I wish I had more cuddle moments with the grandkids. Yeah. So kind of when we combine all of those elements, that is how the winter all experience box was birthed. It's like, you can send it across, across the world to your loved ones so that you're sending them hugs through the characters, or you can buy it for your family and you guys can all cuddle together with the characters. So it's both, but this either way it's sending cuddles, which is so important to me. You know, I'm a hugger. <laughs> so nice. for, for me, it's like sending, you know, giving people the, the time to slow down and actually, you know, when the world is suffering from more stress and emotional overwhelm than ever, a hug and a cuddle is really one of the best antidotes. So this is this is an experience that they can do to do that. I love it. All right, Dominic and Christopher, before we wrap up, let me see those shirts. Give us, let me see that merch you got on. The merch. Oh yeah. No, not yeah, yeah, let me see the merch. <laughs> yes. One at a time. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Let me see yours. Right. Okay. Thank Great. You. Dominic, thank you. Christopher, thank you. Okay. Good stuff. I love it. Yes. I love it. Okay. So Tracy's going to um include some links below just so that you have super easy access to support these beautiful children and their vision to support this small business. I love supporting other small businesses. Really, really important this time of year. Um, but it's more than that. I mean, as you heard Tracy say, this is about, you know, Dominic and Christopher having this vision, this dream very early on, right? And um, there were multiple facets to this dream, which Tracy, you know, good on you for following this through, creating the vision and then the goals to go underneath the vision and then showing them the action steps to take forth, right? We all know, we all know on this call what it takes to get a book published, right? And to um, really move forward with the creation of this vision to be able to hold this in your hand at the end for all of these things that we're seeing here on the screen, right? So um, I'm so proud of all of you. I'm so excited. I'm so proud of all of you. I think this is absolutely amazing. And for those of you out here, we're not just supporting these adorable 
um, creatures. Yes, you and Dominic, I'm talking about you, but also <laughs> the plushy creatures, right? Reach um, all the creatures. But you're supporting a dream, right? And it's so important that we can do this for one another. Um, and so that's what you're doing. It's not just, um, although it is about the cuddles and the beautiful book and the beautiful uh, stuffed animals and plushies that they get to play with, but it's also supporting a dream. Like what more could we want during this holiday season? So thank you so much, you guys, for being here. Thank you for allowing you. all of these people a little glimpse into your world and to the dream that you've created. <laughs> I'm really proud of both of you. Good job, guys. Great job. Thank you so much. Thank you. We appreciate you. So thank happy. you. Yay. We hope Amazing. we hope get a lot of sales today. And I remember, click yeah. click that. Click that buy button so we and to help support the winter out. Make it a classic so that so the children will remember it as just like the Wizard of Oz. Yes. That, that's so cute that you came up with that. He was like saying, What if everyone knows it as much as the winter as the Wizard of Oz? I'm like, that would be amazing. Yeah. So, Little okay. interesting known fact. So the Wizard of Oz was originally written as a children's series. Yep. Wow. So we hope ours could become like expand upon in more books and become a so popular franchise that they make that, that exactly. they like, into a super popular movie. I love this analogy. I am sticking with it. I couldn't oh. have said it better myself. Buy, get, click that purchase button. Exactly. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm so happy for you guys. I am cheering you on. We're going to share, yeah. share your way on this, okay? Yeah. To really get as many eyes on this as possible because this is really important. And this is, this is amazing. This is so, so amazing. I'm so happy. You guys must be like, so thrilled to share this with the world. So thank you congrats. so much, Kate. Huge we appreciate congrats. you. Thank yes. you so much. We I appreciate you, you for being part of this journey with us, with the book. We love you. Thank you. We love Bye. you. All of Bye. you. All right. You. I will thank see you. you all soon. Let's get Bye. those boxes going. <laughs> all right. Bye. 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 Bye.